Joe, what are you doing? Making the first incision. <laughs> what are you talking about? I was thinking about becoming a surgeon and I gotta practice my cuts. <laughs> On a sausage? To you, this is a sausage. To me, it's a ruptured spleen. <laughs> Mrs. G, don't worry. Uh, excuse me, but when one of my girls stays out all night, that's what I do, worry. What if she's had an accident? <laughs> Believe me, anything Blair did last night was no accident. <laughs> <laughs> I just mean she'll show up. Well, Tootie, we better get going. Ah, uh, hold it, Tootie. Where are you going? Where do I always go at 8 o'clock? To the Eastland School for Girls. You can't go to school like that. Why not? I'm expressing my creativity. <laughs> Tootie, write a poem. <laughs> Natalie, you're supposed to be on my side. All right, I'll help you write the poem. <laughs> Look, the worst that'll happen is they'll send me home from school. Uh, a dress like that, I don't think you'll make it to school. Not that you won't be offered plenty of rides. <laughs> Hello, all. Blair! Where have you been? The gang went out for coffee. Coffee? Where'd you go, Boston? <laughs> yeah, how'd you know? And you didn't call to tell me? No. But you were on my mind. Look, bagels for everyone. Oh, great. <laughs> Too bad you didn't stop off in Philadelphia for cream cheese. <laughs> you drove all the way to Boston for coffee? That's so collegiate. Just think next year I'll be able to do that. All over my new ulcers. Blair, Blair, why didn't you pick up the phone and let me know you wouldn't be home? You're really going to read her the riot act, aren't you? Tootie, please. Blair, this is not like you. You call that the riot act? What do we got here? Two sets of rules, one for the big kids and one for me? There are not two sets of rules here. What we have in this house is a mutual agreement as to what is acceptable behavior. Oh, ooh, that's good. <laughs> oh, I get it. You only get the riot act if you stay out all night and wear leg warmers. Well, hate to eat and run. Blair, you know we got an economics test in 15 minutes. I didn't know that. You would if you came to class once in a while. Just a minute, Blair. Are you cutting classes? Only the boring ones. What is going on here? That's the last straw, isn't it? Tootie, shush! Blair, I want you to come back here after your last class. We have to talk. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't. I have a date. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Trust me. <laughs> Does she? No, she doesn't. Blair, you're grounded. I'm what? You're grounded. <laughs> Mrs. Garrett, you're not my mother, or my guardian, or my conscience. You're my landlady. Hey. Now, I'm leaving now, and I'll be back when I get back. 